Oh. Let's get into focus here. All right, let's get into it. Black Kemet gods, yeah. black Egyptian gods, go. summoned from heaven, blessed, dressed in only go yard. So, uh, go ahead and kind of preface this video. This video is not to like to take shots at front page tech or AKA John Prosner, like his character uh, outside of YouTube, right? So this has nothing to do with that. I don't know this dude from a can of paint. You feel what I'm saying? This is more so just how I notice how he moves throughout the YouTube space and no count on Twitter. Not count on Twitter, a lot on Twitter. So it's just me like stating my opinion on it. But this video is not gonna be bashing him the whole video. It's just really telling you what I don't like about his channel or why I don't like his channel. But I will be throwing some good stuff in it too. I ain't just gonna just dump right in and start because it's not like I'm hating, I just go straight into the video. Well, I don't like him because it is. Like, yeah, it's kind of corny. Without further ado, it's gonna get into the video. The reason why I do not like John Prosner's AKA Front Page Tech channel is, is really because when I watch his videos, I kind of get like a sense, and this, again, just a personal perspective, a sense of arrogance, then it's like, <laughs> my dude, <laughs> Humble yourself. I mean, don't get me wrong. He's made great strides and within the like within his YouTube career. I mean, to see the space that he's blew up in, as much you know, it's advertising again. Like I know my man's out there getting you know getting his bread, so I'm not even really tripping on that. You know what I'm saying? Like hats off to you, my guy. You doing your thing out there, but it's just this sense of arrogance that I get. It's like yo, my dude, you chill out. You know what I'm saying? Like, even though like the way sometimes he talks to his subscribers, like especially on Twitter, like on Twitter, my man's be having his chest like poked out, fully extended. Like if you look at coming some of his tweets, I'm like yo, my dude like <laughs> like chill out my guy like there was one situation in particular and this could be of a bias against that already right because it's kind of like what i realized like yo my, my man's you tripping right now so there was an issue with lover of tech one of my good compadres i've been meant to do a day in my life but he just cool as hell i rocks with him right make sure you check out his channel it was a situation where level of tech just pretty much stated his opinion again just his opinion and the way my man's john prosten reacted to it it was like yo my dude it's just a but it's, it's an opinion, my guy, like, why is it weighing so heavy on you? You know what I'm saying? In, in the in the way he went about handling the situation, like some of the stuff he was saying, some of the vulgarity he was using, like, don't get me wrong, we all grown man. Curse all you want. I just got an issue with, if I'm talking to you, but I using curse words, don't use curse words to me. So if I'm talking to you like boom, boom, boom. You slipping a curse word, oh, okay. Either I'm gonna just end the conversation right there or this conversation gonna go a different route. You feel what I'm saying? Like, there's no need for that. And then you had other individuals just kinda like jumping in, uh, I guess, speak up for him or whatever. And I was like, yo, like this is, all this is based off an opinion of someone just giving an opinion on how he's doing things. I think it was in regards to his creator of the week. Shout out to Team Forest Walkers in the building. I just felt like it was just a little bit too much. And even then, like sometimes when I look at some of his response he posts on Twitter to some of his subscribers or just the way he kind of comes off, it's just really, it's like kind of arrogant and it's like, it's, it's unwelcoming, right? Like the way he comes across to me is like, yo, I'm like, the best YouTube channel out there, which you should feel that way, but it's again, it's all about how you do it. Like, you ain't gotta be like, yeah, I'm the best, and it's kind of like, throw it in your face if you like it or not. It's more of a humble approach. Like me, I would feel I'm the realest, best tech YouTuber out there, but just the way I carry myself, people gonna get that from me. Like, I don't have to dismantle anyone else or kind of like put someone at a lower standard to kind of raise me up. And I just kind of, even the way he attacks, and the thing is, even the way he attacks some of the journalists and his thing, and don't get me wrong, like if journalists are going public with the way they, you know, if you don't like the way they're handling your situation, then you do the same thing. But again, it's all about how you worry stuff. And I just feel like sometimes his wording can kind of come off like, look, ignorant, you know what I mean? Like, I'd be thinking like, Man, I don't know how I would take that if he was directing that towards me. But to kind of get off the negative side for a little bit, my man's has done great things in the YouTube community. I'm not gonna lie, you know what I'm saying? Like his created a weak thing. Like I felt what he's doing, trying to bring up the smaller YouTube. I respect him for that. You know what I'm saying? It's to lose to him. Um, just the way he's kind of pushing, like the fact that more journalists, like big newspapers, coming are coming to tech YouTubers such as himself. It's a it's a great uh, door opener for people like me to kind of get into that realm as well. But just again, as far as the way he handled his channel, maybe just his media presence as a whole, I really ain't feeling it. Uh, does that mean that I dislike the guy? No, nope, don't know his ass. Um, you know, I can't really say I dislike the dude, just dislike his person, his media personality. Behind closed door, this dude may be the chillest person you've ever met in your life, but the way he carries himself on media, it's like, I really don't rock with you, cuz. But that's okay, you know what I mean? Like, I'm just, and that's just me coming as a viewer, not really as a YouTuber, it's like, I'm viewing these channels strictly from a YouTuber's, I mean, strictly as a viewer's perspective, right? I've watched their videos at some point, I was even subscribed to their channel, you know what I mean? I just don't like the way he moves, that's kind of why I'm no longer a subscriber of his channel. But again, that's just me. So. Just to kind of let you guys know, <clears throat> we done with John Prosser. Now, John Prosser, you off, you off 
the table, my guy, you can, you can step down. Just kind of let y'all know, I'm not doing this to kind of come at bigger YouTubers. That's not the angle. I actually hate YouTubers that do that shit. This is me just kind of giving my opinion, my critique about just the way that person handles their media or just their channel in general. But I'm not just going out the bigger names. Like I'm going out the smaller people too. And I'm just not doing YouTubers I dislike. I'm doing YouTubers I like as well. Travis, MCP, whatever, <laughs> you up next. I'm pretty sure you already kind of see where I'm going with this, this series where you may kind of fall in that category, but yeah, you you definitely up next. Yeah, John Prosner, I don't like your YouTube channel because of the way you kind of, your media presence as a whole. And sometimes even, uh, I sometimes get a lot of arrogance even watching your YouTube channel. Just my opinion, we could talk about it. When to do a live stream, I'm open to that. When I have an open debate on Twitter, I'm open to that as well. I'm not gonna be one of those dudes who say something behind the curtain or even publicly and then fray away from it. Like, if you got a problem with what I said, address me, you can talk about it like men or whatever the case is, or it may not even be that much of a big issue to me. To me, I wouldn't even, I wouldn't, I wouldn't respond to me just being real. I don't even see the point. It's just somebody giving their opinion. But uh, you know, whatever you wanna do, I'm open to it and uh, it is what it is. Hope you enjoy the series. Oh, wait, one more important thing I forgot to say. My my subscribers, my fans, anybody who comment, you can list or tweet me or Instagram me, Sean Be Nice uh, is my handle everywhere, Instagram and Twitter, about the YouTubers you don't like or you do like and that you feel like I should either kind of dissect, shout out to the Law Twins, and I will, you know what I'm saying, I do that, I do my due diligence, do my homework and kind of get, you know what I'm saying, get your input, and you kind of list the points of why you don't like this person and I will see if my reasons for disliking or liking them kind of line up with yours and then boom, that would be the next person for the week, but Next week, I already got my person planned out. Travis, <laughs> you up next, my dude. And it's gonna be fun. So this is not, again, this is not trying to bring poison to the YouTube community. It's just kind of do something fresh and different. And yeah, I kind of like it. I like which is, I like the fact that I'm able just to express my opinion and my feelings on something without kind of having to then be worried about what's gonna happen next. It's kind of like just me stating my opinion. If you don't like it, then we can address that whichever, whichever way you see fit. We're gonna do a live stream, we gonna talk about it, the text message, personal phone call, whatever. I'm with it all, I'm not gonna, again, I'm not gonna throw a shot and then be like, oh no, I, you know, oh Jesus. Nah, B, that's, I'm a, I'm a grown ass man. So we're gonna talk about it, you can talk about it. If you don't, whatever, chalk it up. It's your boy Sean Be Nice, man. If you enjoyed the video, hit the thumbs up, comment down which YouTuber you want me to do next, whether you like them or dislike them. Didn't like the video. If you feel that it is gonna be toxic for the community, if you feel what I'm doing is completely wrong and you, don't, and you think I should stop now, whether you're a YouTuber or a viewer, hit the dislike button and say, Sean, stop now while you're ahead. And then I kind of go from there. You feel what I'm saying? But either way, <laughs> either way, Travis, I'm telling you right, you're still up next week. Regardless of what they say for this video, Travis, you still up for next week. So, it's your boy Sean be nice, man. Hope you enjoyed the video and I'm out. Deuces.